Welcome back to Part of the Interruption. I'm your host, Zach James, along with my co-host, Kate Lassiter and Haley Apps. Today, talking about Simone Biles. So Simone Biles, 27 years old, coming back from some injuries. Paris Olympics 2024, can she come back and win a gold? I mean, I definitely think she can. She was first rejected to go back to the Olympics this year, but has fully trained her way back and is now back in. And now she has had some injuries before which might complicate coming back to the Olympics, but she's worked her way back and got accepted. So I think she can make her way back. Although she has worked really hard, she's getting old. If you think about it, she's 27. That's getting up there in the ages for being a gymnast. You need to be springy to bounce all over the place. And she's just getting older. She's more injury prone. She just came back from an injury. It's not worth the risk. She's just not as good as she was back in her prime. Well, I do think that's true. She's won several gold medal Olympics. She won in Rio in 2016 and in the 2020 Tokyo Olympics. I think in Paris in 2024, she has full ability. Her strengths are outweigh her weaknesses, and I think that she can just she can come back and she can win it again. I understand that, but when it comes to history. I mean, once again, she's getting older. It's going to affect her. She can't just, like, go there and just, you know, perform her best. Like, she just came as she's, like, 20 years old. She's not 20 anymore. She's about to be 30. She's closer to 30 than she is 20. She's getting old. She's just not as good as she used to be. Well, speaking about injuries, Kirk Cousins coming back from injury, torn Achilles with the Minnesota Vikings, now signing a four-year contract with the Atlanta Falcons. Falcons, however, did take Michael Penix Jr. out of Washington at pick number eight of the 2024 NFL Draft. So who starts? Haley, I'll start with you. Well, I think Kirk needs to work his butt off. He needs to, he has a number eight pick right behind him, ready to take his spot on the field. He needs to do all he can to stay in shape, do what's best for the team. And if he does it, well, there's someone else waiting for him, so. I definitely think Michael will take the field over Kirk Cousins. He was the number eight pick in the draft. He took Washington and led them to the national championships. I think that he can lead the Falcons through playoffs, possibly to even the Super Bowl. But I think he will take it over Kirk Cousins. Don't get me wrong. I think Michael Penix is amazing, a great player, but so is Kirk. He has experience much more than Michael. Therefore, he could be a better player this season. And if he's working hard, he can keep that position on the field. Well, Michael Penix is a much younger quarterback and he just got out of, his, uh, out of the college, uh, out of college football. So I think that he'll do great in the NFL and I think he'll go over Kirk Cousins because Kirk Cousins has had a lot of injuries recently. And I think he'll be more injury prone this season. Well, that is part of the interruption. We will head to commercial break really quick. Coming back, we will talk about the Dodgers and their World Series odds. <laughs> 